This is Isabel Payer with your News in 90. The National Weather Service confirmed today that the damage and debris from a Sunday night storm in South Florida was actually from a tornado. Yesterday, a storm drove through Hialeah, Florida, leaving it in ruins. The center's meteorologists say that the tornado had winds up to 85 miles per hour and went on for about half a mile. The center says no individuals were hurt or harmed during the duration of the storm. The beginnings of a peace deal between the U.S. and the Taliban are in the works. U.S. Special Representative for Afghanistan declared today the possibility of the deal. He says the deal's terms include the withdrawal of U.S. troops from Afghanistan and, in return, the Taliban promised to put forth all efforts in mitigating terrorism in the country. The representative says this peace deal may bring Afghanistan's long-running war to an end. Today, a group of people are acting out after the 34th Street Wall got a MAGA makeover. Yesterday, MAGA supporters painted the wall with messages supporting Trump's border wall and his America First agenda. Wearing Trump hats as they painted, they heard, they heard honks of support and read texts of complaints and threats. Some people are even planning to repaint the wall. Facebook events were created to paint over the messages and hide the Trump slogans. The event organizers say opposing parties were already arriving to repaint the wall this afternoon. That's your news in 90, but your Florida news is always on at WUFT.org.